let's understand lexical scope in javascript let's take a look at this code it has a function with a function an arrow inside javascript has a global or window top level dictionary and if we create objects it creates a dictionary with proto or prototype in brackets so here is the scope of the outer function this is known as a constructor function because we are saying new so this is a constructor function this however is a regular function inside that constructor function and this happens to be an arrow function which is inside this constructor function and they all behave slightly differently so when we create this object and we instantiate this object and the function is called regular functions do not point to the outer scope all regular functions point to global or window on the other hand the arrow function does not point to global it points to its lexical scope which is being defined by this function called employee so if you say this it instead points to the employee this and it prints the employee id now let's take a look of look at this code we have this constructor function where we put id and name we instantiate an object and print it so as expected it prints id 1 name brendan now we put a regular function and this points to global so even if we are inside this constructor function a regular function will continue to point to global so if you run this we will see undefined undefined the reason if we were to debug and check this is pointing to global and there is no id or name in global dictionary because we have not put it there this is what we are talking about that any regular function regardless of where it is located in your code this by default points to the global or window so let's go ahead and compare this with what happens in case of an arrow function an arrow function this points to whoever is outside and outside is employee constructor function so in this case when we print we will actually get one and brendan because in case of arrow function it is the lexical scope where it goes and looks at uh this so in javascript the regular function will always point to global and arrow function will always point to whoever is outside 